Fear of unseen agency is alive and well in various supernatural forms. The QAnon conspiracy raises once again the collective and individual fear of satanic political plotting, and it allies with the reptilian overlords conspiracy theory promoted by a former British TV presenter. As to the reception of technology, the recent beliefs regarding 5G and chemtrails and the concerns over the unseen agents held responsible are not dissimilar to the worries about infernal machines and electricity expressed by asylum patients. The rise of the internet and social media creates large, global, virtual communities of such believers, helping to amplify the unorthodox beliefs and convictions born of individual anxieties, delusions, and barefaced lies. Contrast this with the isolated 19th century asylum patients desperately trying to promote their conspiracies or proclaim their divinity through letters that were either censored or thrown in the bin by superintendents. With regard to religion, millions of Christian evangelicals continue to believe in the imminent second coming of Christ, while self-styled prophets have thrived in contemporary America in particular, just as they did in the days of the Millerite madness. Whole new faith systems such as Scientology continue to emerge without being condemned by the medical profession as outbreaks of mass insanity, as were the early LDS church and spiritualism. Many small cults and religious sects have also come and gone, some ending in tragic circumstances. If we engage in a little magical thinking ourselves, what would the early psychiatrists have made of all this if they could have travelled forwards in time?